Well, it's a day later. It's a day later and this little creature is still around. It's about lunchtime, just after lunch, just after, what is it? Getting out towards one o'clock. And it somehow lodged itself with this gut, piece of guttering. I touched the metal, it's not super hot. I hope it's not stuck. Looks a bit stuck, but I don't know if it is. Why would it choose such a position as that, I wonder? The metal's warm, but it's not so hot I can't keep my fingers on it. I'll have a look at its front. I just hope it's not stuck in that ridiculous looking position. Our little echidna. That looks like the front end. I don't know if it's sleeping or if it's stuck or what. I don't want to touch it. I looked about, I read about them and they can be injured if you uh, mishandle them. I don't know how it got in there or what it's doing. Let's see if you can get out of that. Well, we turned the gutter upside down. We turned the gutter upside down and tipped it out just in case it was trapped. I don't know that it was trapped, but we tipped it out. I think it's trying to bury itself. Well, that's very good camouflage. It looks just like grass, doesn't it? Just like grass. Unfortunately, I can't get a good shot of its face because it's determined to bury itself. It's disappearing. Can we see it's big? I don't think I'm going to get a good shot of its face. That maybe. Well, it's safely in there now under all that wormwood and shrubbery and everything. So it's completely, I can't get to it easily. So that's that. It's safe, it's got a good hiding place now. Let's hope it finds some ni nice ants. Somewhere in there it is, hidden safely away. It's 
see you then. Well, that little Aussie hedgehog is gone now. But here's a little... I'm just on my way back to the house and I come across, came across this little blue tongue. It's having a sun bath on this autumn day. And I'm starting all adenoidy, aren't I, from hay fever. Oh. Someone's having a sun bath. I read online that you shouldn't handle blue tongues either. These little lizards can be easily damaged too. We have rescued them on occasion, but we don't usually touch them. I think it's just having a sun bath. Isn't it lovely? Just sitting quietly in the sunshine. Let's watch its breathing. Look at this little, is it thorax or something? <laughs> going up and down. Isn't it cute? Beautiful stripes. Perhaps it's listening to that cricket. Listen to that cricket. 